Hey everyone there at Rhino Roofing. My name is Esmeralda and I work here with SEO Monster Design. And I was actually doing some uh, research here in Albuquerque and I came across your website and just figured you guys can use some help. Um, I'm going to give you three tips in this video to help you guys actually boost your online presence. And getting some more customers is going to be the ultimate goal. But if by the end of this video you like what you heard and you can see that I have a lot of tricks up my sleeve that can help your business grow. Um, give me a call or maybe we some uh we can get together sometime and we can chat. If not, you know, feel free to use these tips for yourself. So the three things I wanted to go over with you guys is gonna be content, citations, and backlinks. These are some um some of the important things when it comes to ranking your website. So the first thing is gonna be content. So Content is basically anything you see on your website, including your pictures, what the pictures are saved as, and what's behind the pictures. And why it's important, you want to make sure you have enough content on your front page. That really explains what do you guys do. Also, by having enough content on your front page, you'll be able to add in key words, key terms, key phrases that people are using to try to search for people that do your services. Um, so that's the first tip. You want to make sure you have more unique authoritative keywords. So that way the content that you do have on there, that will help drive in more business to your business uh, through search engine. So that is tip number one. And also what I wanted to, when I talk about the pictures, is if I right click on this and I put save image as, right here it will show me what your image is saved as. So if you guys were to use a keyword such as uh, rhino roofing or, you know, roofers in Albuquerque, um, just save each, each picture that you guys have as a keyword that actually boosts your uh, website and it gets you uh, more customers. So the second thing that I wanted to go over with you guys is citations. And so if I go here, and all I did was go to Roofing Albuquerque, New Mexico. And the first thing we will see is going to be the ads. And this is more like a gamble. You're not really guaranteed to get customers when you do ads. And there's actually a, a big group of people that will not click on ads. And it's maybe because they've had bad experiences with ads. And most people have um, ad blockers. So they won't even see your ads. So anybody that is actually running ads is not really 100% that you will get business from there. But it does help you um, to get on the top. But what I'm talking about citations is citate. Uh, it's essentially for your bit. It's sorry. It's your business name, your phone number, and your address listed through the web in various uh directory so what a directory is is you can think of it like a face like facebook um yelp yellow pages anywhere online where it allows for businesses to list their business information and services to ultimately have another avenue for customers to find them so that's tip number two if you want to beat out your uh competitors in your area you need to make sure you're doing what they are doing and a little more if your competitor is on Facebook, you need to be on Facebook. If they're on Yellow Pages, then you need to be on uh, be on there. It's a way, there's a way we can identify what your competition is using as far as citations, and we can actually help you get the same ones as, um, as well. So that's the second tip, just going out there and finding places to put your business. So... Third and final thing I wanted to go over with you guys is backlinks. And that has to do with this um, organic section right here. You want to make sure you have the content on there like we had discussed, um, discussed earlier. But also backlinks. What that is is essentially another website that is sending a link to you um, saying that you guys are great roofing company in Albuquerque and that's what you do and that will actually give you another avenue for customers to reach you so that's going to help you rank 
in the search engine, which is down here. And if I look at one of your competitors right here, it's it's a very simple site, as you guys can see. Um, they do have just a little bit more content and their pictures. Um, but it's nothing that, you know, we can't help you guys with. And we can easily add some content for you guys and beat them. So, I wanted to show you this thing right here. So, looking at your backlinks, this is actually a tool called Arifs. It's not really 100% accurate. Um, you're going to get all your most accurate information from Google if you guys have your Google Analytics set up correctly on your website. But this can actually give me information that would tell me what's actually working for you guys and what's not. And right here, I can see that you guys only have 87 referring domains that are giving you 245 backlinks. So more importantly, backlinks are not going to do much for you if you're not getting found for the keywords and the key phrases that are going to drive traffic to your website. So if we look at your competitors, their referring domains are 94, which is getting them 753 backlinks. So you guys are not even that far behind. If I go here, we can actually see what keywords they are using. Um, metal Roofing Albuquerque, Roofing Company Albuquerque, Roofers Albuquerque. These are actually the type of keywords you're going to want to get up in the search engine to bring, or, uh, so you can start bringing in new business if that's what you're looking for. So that is everything that I wanted to go over with you guys. Um, sorry, I went over a little longer than I wanted it to, but hopefully this was informative and educational for you and hope these tips can help, uh, bring you guys more business. So if you guys, um, work on these three things, which is content citations and backlinks, you guys will start, uh, beating your competition online. If you would like to actually know more about how SEO Monster Design can help you and get a, a strategy together for you, uh, just give me a call and we can chat. But thanks for your time and thanks for watching this video and hope to hear back from you guys.